what is going on? The official urban therapist. Wait a minute now. Okay. Urban therapist, you're going to give us some words of encouragement now? Oh, I'm, I'm going to do it all for y'all. Okay. So what you got <laughs> um, on the topic? For first, of, first of all, Ms. Courtney, I appreciate you inviting me on the platform. Ms. Mosaic, how you doing today? And how everybody doing in the chat as Good. well this evening? Um, yes, I, I am the official urban therapist. I'm actually uh, going to school for this very subject that we're talking about, which is uh, psychotherapy and uh, sociology. So I, I wanted to come on here just to, just to give you my um, perspective from, about this, this topic. Mm -hmm. now, um, now, from a general sense, um, no, man, no man, no woman is meant to be alone at all, period. It's just, it's just part of our human nature. Uh, Regardless, uh, we're either going to have interaction with each other, which is human beings, or we're going to have interaction with nature. So it's going to happen uh, regardless, regardless of your personality type. Let's say, for example, you're an introvert, you're going to be with something, whether it's a dog, a cat, something, you know, whether you're mm -hmm. an extrovert, you know, uh, regardless of the fact, uh, we always going to. Uh, I was going to have some type of interaction. Now, if you want, if you're speaking about it for us in a relationship perspective, uh, I believe in a relationship perspective, um, there are certain type of people who can be alone, and they they could achieve, um, you know, being in a relationship alone. Uh, matter of fact, I think the the not Mr. Rucker, but the, the other guy, he was kind of speaking a little bit from a biblical perspective. Mm -hmm. um, I'm, I'm reminded in the uh, New Testament. Of, about what uh what uh the apostle Paul said, where where uh, where he was pretty much on telling people that um hey if you could if you want to be married then you could be married if if not then then uh, you prefer you uh, prefer to be alone you know what I'm saying be alone for the work of the kingdom and so so in other words there are so many there there are people that really can be alone and they can live their life alone without being in a relationship with uh. That could be in a platonic relationship, but you know, not in an intimate relationship and achieve that. But then also there are other people who need to, you know, be in a relationship like myself. Uh, I'm not one of those types that I, I need to be in a relationship. Uh, and I'm pretty sure on other some um Miss Mosa, I believe you you say you're married. Yeah, well, so so we 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 need to uh, be in a relationship. We we need that sense of companionship, that's you know, so we can want to live our everyday life. You know, yeah. But for us, oh, uh, one other thing, you talking about the man too, right? Now, mm -hmm. um, I I have not ran into no man whatsoever who who said that they cannot be alone. Even men needs needs on um, companionship, one way or the other. This is the reason why you 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 have some men who are in you know, monogamous relationship. You have men who are polyamorous relationships because mm -hmm. they need that that sense of companionship. You know, period. Yeah. Yeah, I, I hear. And I think uh, it's been a lot of talk about polyamory and being in those particular kind of re relationships where, you know, if you believe it or not, or it's something that you want to try, it's the idea of, you know, I'd rather be in a polyamory relationship than not be in one at all. And I think people are looking for other options to the traditional monogamy. And then it's like, well, why? Is this something because, you know, past five years, it's been very popular, especially amongst black folks. This was always like a white thing that I always saw. But now black people are kind of in it within America. And I'm sure, you know, people say it was done in Africa back in the day. Well, I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about here in the States. And, you know, why? You're willing to do a lot of stuff not to be alone. But then does that equate to not being lonely? So, mm -hmm. well, I appreciate I appreciate you, urban therapist. Thank you for blessing us this evening. Are you Are you so welcome?